You'll need a tennis court, a basket of 30 or more balls, an empty basket to pick balls up, two 39-foot lines to mark target areas, one 60-foot line to mark power line, score sheets, clipboard and pencil, masking tape to attach the line to the court, 16-foot tape measure, and a marking pen to mark the court. The participants are a player, a feeder who is the SSV court official, a scorekeeper, and a ball person. Determine the target areas by locating the placement of the control lines. Measure 81 inches in from the outside of the single sideline on both sides, making small marks at the net, service line, and baseline. Lay one control line on the deuce court from the net to the baseline, taping at the marks. Do the same on the ad court. These lines create control target areas. Second, determine the power area by locating the placement of the power line behind the baseline. Start by locating a point directly behind the center mark and 15 feet from the outside of the baseline. Make another small mark. Then on both the add and deuce sides, measure 13 feet behind the outside corner of where the single sideline and the baseline meet, making small marks again. Locate the center of the 60-foot power line and tape it down at the 15-foot mark. Then, extend the two ends one in each direction so that they cross the 13-foot marks, thus forming a V-shape behind the baseline. Third, locate the feeder position by marking the center line four feet from the net with a six-inch piece of tape. Fourth, locate the ball bounce spot by making a mark nine feet behind the service line in the center of the court. Do this with two six-inch pieces of tape. 